I'm 11 months locked today and I actually feel like I have a lot to update on this month. So I washed my hair for the first time, like actually myself. And I just took some old Aussie shampoo and I put it in my hands and I really like watered it down so I wouldn't like really build up. And that's why I washed my hair. I was noticing build up here at the front. Um, it's just kind of flaky. And it was kind of like agitating because I'm so used to having loose hair and whenever there's like build up or anything, one, I can just like easily jump in the shower and wash my hair. And two, um, if it's like something that could like, like a flake or something that I could pull out, I can like actually pull it all the way out. I was really worried that it was because of the gel that was being used to retwist my hair because I would never seen that before. And it just seemed like that's what it was because I don't put like anything in my hair when I'm um, maintaining it myself. I just spray it with stuff and sometimes I'll do oil. But yeah, it was just like flaking up. So I washed it and it was really nice to wash it. I actually really enjoyed that. And also this month, I really enjoyed the grown out stage of my hair. Um, just like the thickness part. I guess I just kind of knew what I was getting in for every day. And so what I would do is I would just like braid my hair like I've showed it multiple times throughout this journey and pin it. I did that every day and I was worried about like tension on the perimeter of my hair and pulling it and thinning it out and stuff, but I didn't notice any issues with that. And what I also did this month was I trimmed my ends. So as you can see, they all look so much more like concealed and not as stringy. And that was like actually a big adjustment. Once I got my hair retwisted, I got my hair retwisted last weekend. I was having like body dysmorphia for hair. I just felt like my hair had suddenly gotten so much shorter. But then I went back and I looked at other months and I was like, oh, my hair isn't as short as I think it is. It's just like perspective, I guess, and how it felt. But it's been really nice to have all those stringy ends cut off. It just feels a lot more um, strong and like full. So I love that. There's like still a little something here. I can't really describe it. It's like kind of stringy, um, not fully locked. But that was really nice to do. Yeah, so that's just been this month so far. And then this hairstyle. So I've been wanting to do, I really, really enjoyed making the updates every month and like editing them different ways and like, showing the differences but um one I've noticed that whenever I do like a before or after if I go get my hair retwisted or from showing like pictures or taking pictures for this I like don't take pictures anymore as I've gotten older and I'm always like RBF every single one and usually it's just me adjusting to my hair and I just don't care to like change how I look but so sorry about that because I know the ones in this video are pretty bad what I feel like I have learned from liking the grown out part is that once I hit a year, I want to try to stretch my twist, retwist out a little bit more to also combat thinning in that way. So right now I try to get my hair retwisted every six weeks. So um, we'll see how that continues. But yeah, 11 months. I can't wait for 12. But I've been having so much fun with like hairstyles and doing new things with my hair. And this month I had this hairstyle in my head because I feel like all of these hairstyles are so like inner child esque and this one i don't know if it's xenon or lauren hill because i just see like pink and purple i think it's xenon but she has like two she had like two or one up and it was like pink and i don't know if it was like metallic or what but i settled on these i got a bunch of these little like different color like little bulb things they kind of like cherries you know and so i did those um, but I wanted to get like these sparkly hair accessories and do two of those. So maybe one day I'll do that look, but it's been so fun just to come on here and do my hair a different way. Even though it's still like the two pigtails and it's so simple, it's been so fun to find other little accessories and clips to put in my hair. I got these like crazy sparklers ones that are like probably for like a Halloween costume or something, but they're just too big. So maybe I'll cut them down or use those but it's been really fun and um so this outfit I kind of I feel like it's giving like Van Gogh starry night vibes I'm wearing star earrings but I did go to this um Van Gogh it's like it's like a I think it's called like beyond Van Gogh and I went in the beginning of the summer with my friends and I vlogged it and I don't really vlog anymore so I'm gonna like share that here it was a really fun time it was cool to see all of this work so yeah but that's all I have to share today um 
I'm really excited for a year. I've had so much fun doing these videos. I'm excited to do the one year video. Um, thanks for watching. Thank you.